I don't think this is what I was. That's that's not gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys ready for the real bushcraft today? Let's do that! Bushcraft America. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Nice to have you all back. Today we are doing a little bushcraft trip. Look who's there. Oh, this is Marco and Mitch. Step. This is Mitch. This is Marco. My buddies. And where are you from, Marco? I'm from Mexico, Chihuahua, Mexico, actually. Awesome. Yeah. We just met you at work. Oh yeah. Agreed <laughs> for a little bushcraft adventure. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. How is the weather supposed to be? It's a thunderstorm all night. Thunderstorm all night. Oh, that's that sounds exciting. We have the woods behind you guys. And we'll spot out there and see what we're made of. Before we start to walk into the woods, um, I have some leftovers, and each of you have to empty a magazine. America. That's an empty one. Here's another one. Okay, again, instructions. Put the magazine in safety off for the charging handle all the way back and let it snap stream something cool and let it fly it's america baby yeah let's go and hit the woods yeah all right okay we are right now in a remote training facility usually the navy seals train here it's the gravy seals today. <laughs> the gravy seals. I want to get them training in because I'm planning to go on an extended off-road motorcycle trip. We want to train with, with a few different camp setups and cooking setups. Marco just picked up his equipment at Walmart and yeah. Best Pro Shop, right? <laughs> yeah. I think I have a lighter and uh, I think a plastic fork. I think that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's freaking awesome. A plastic fork and a lighter. Real bushcraft here. <laughs> so I have a plastic fork and a plastic knife. Ooh, that's even more advanced, yeah. guys. I have a freaking machete. And a flag. <laughs> that's all you need. Widowmakers, dead tree limbs above us. So wherever we find a spot, a few bad a spot like this, where you have two spots where you can put a hammock, another spot, and in the middle can be the fire and Marv sleep on the ground, wherever. That's that's right. <laughs> Something like that. So we have already an instructor for us, Marco. Mitch is our bushcraft instructor. Yeah, I read a couple pages in a book. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's pretty handy. Yeah, it's only like five dollars at Walmart. What are you using for a tour right now? Oh, hatchet. Yeah. Oh, I think you have to steal the cover on. Oh, that's why it's not cutting. <laughs> All right, now. Okay, it looks way better. All right. <laughs> I'm probably going to set my hammock up between these two trees and he'll go between those two trees. So I'm going for the ground setup. I don't want to have all the leaves under me. Yes, I think this is tick paradise, right? So I clean here all the branches. Gun in the rain. It doesn't rust. It's like super duty awesome steel. I'm going with a special German military sleeping pad. Claims to be the most comfortable sleeping pad out there. Right. Here guys, all you need is a machete and an AK. Right <laughs> nice bushcraft. I was in a hurry, so I just picked this. Walmart. And that's not a hammock? No, there's no hammock. We can rig it up and make something work at least. So, looks like someone else is sleeping on the floor. <laughs> Bushcraft. <laughs> you also have to enjoy. So, that will be pretty interesting, guys. Let's see how the camps looks like after everything is set up. So, Marco, introduce us to your camp setup. Looks like you are stranded on an island. Well, that's the best that I can do because I was thinking to buy a hammock. The only thing that I bought was that thing there. Oh, that's like the mosquito cover, Yeah, right? exactly, yes. So, like this, 
and it's gonna keep me safe from the mosquitoes, right? This is my mosquito idea, minimalist way. And that's my setup. To be honest, I copied my setup from Marco, not my idea, but I think that's a really good concept. And yeah, we will see. Yeah, the bugs are killing us. Push crap. Push crap. <laughs> you need them? <laughs> Just lighted up the fire. Nothing spectacular this time. Let's make the fire a little bit bigger here. Oh, yeah. So Mitch is finally done with this setup. Here it is. Nice, yeah. Okay, underneath you got the hammock. Not touching either side. Mosquito in that. That'll keep me dry. It'll keep me warm. Takes down on both sides. Cool. The rain will come off of it nicely. I'm really impressed with the setup. It's nice. And we can put also the firewood now underneath it. Oh, good job, buddy. I should have. What I should have done was made everything higher and put everything over Marco's tent. I like this <laughs> idea. <laughs> that's the bread, though. How do you like the stick bread? <laughs> it's sticky, that's for sure. It doesn't come off. Yeah, Marco, campfire. <laughs> dropping a little bit rain right now but they're not too bad yeah we hope it will stay like it is right now i did that already a hundred times the u.s army control liner here over my blanket wool blanket here and i have just the bundeswehr army ground sheet here so our oh, fire is still burning there Cool. Oh, I like the sound of the bacon. Pancakes going on here. How are the pancakes? Good. Bushcraft knife in there. <laughs> yeah, that was my first try. Frisbee that one. Ah, out of the cam. <laughs> so this setup is getting the thumbs down for me. It's not a pancake pan. That one will be better. <laughs> Three thousand dollars. Do you make that much? <laughs> oh no, we got a little hole in it. From the ashes. Oh, I really like the new stove here. Oh, that's pretty nice. I like the color. I have one uh, at yeah? home. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. really it's, awesome. It's, uh... <laughs> we took a big old bite out of it. Yeah. <laughs> made like all of the 18 eggs it's a little bit unnecessary but <laughs> <laughs> and the steaks turned out to be really good we are about to get the camp packed up if it was nice out i'd be staying and we'd be hiking but that's right a warm shower and warm bed right yeah we don't need to get sick <laughs> and the scenes <laughs> getting everything ready and then we can think already about another bushcraft adventure thank you guys for watching and see y'all next time bye bushcraft america